When you mention the word Orlando, what comes immediately to mind? America's theme parks in Florida. Like Universal Orlando, you can come here and take Spider-Man, one of my favorite rides. But if you want to get a little more wet, well, then you come over here for the Jurassic Park ride. Watch what happens right about, oh, now. Or you can go to Disney World and check out their newest ride, Expedition Everest. There's about a mile of track on Expedition Everest, a ride that took Disney nearly three years to build. The mountain behind me, it's about 200 feet tall. And the drop, well, you better get ready. That drop is about, oh, 200 feet. But for some folks, Orlando is much, much more than just the theme parks. How about an airboat tour of the Everglades? Just 19 miles from Orlando, the ride started in 1995 for adults, 1595 for kids aged 3 to 12. Want something a little faster? Check out the Richard Petty driving experience. This is as close to NASCAR as you can get, or maybe want to get. Eight laps around the track in a 600 horsepower stock car. Last but not least, it's Gatorland. 110 acres of alligators and more alligators. This place has been around since 1949. Alligators and crocodiles in all stages of development. Watch the alligators and every once in a while, wrestle the alligators. The bottom line, come to Orlando, spend some time in the theme parks, and then get outside the theme parks to see all the things Orlando has to offer. I guarantee you, you'll be pleasantly surprised.